life as mum and dad. <laughs> <laughs> it's been challenging, but it's been fun, ain't it? Like, we're so happy, ain't we? It's hard work. It's hard work. Tiring. Yeah. Tiring, more than anything. Babies are fine. Yeah, babies are fine. It's just us, we're tired. Yeah, we're tired. Very tired. Night so, before we went Nando's. Yeah, we went Nando's the we night before. We went Nando's the night before. That was so nice. Because you had to stop eating at the 8 o'clock in the evening, wasn't it? Yeah, and there was like, have a big meal, so we was like, right, Nando's. What did I have? Half chicken, half chicken, rice got, and coleslaw. Did we get a chicken platter? Oh yeah, we did. We got a whole chicken. Whole we chicken went platter. in. <laughs> and then we went, made sure the bags were all packed. Yeah, because I got all that done. Set Check an alarm for half five. I was awake at like three o'clock in the morning. We were so excited <laughs> the next day, like in the morning. It was the most amazing day. It was like the best day, weren't it? It was a bit of a whirlwind for me. Luke remembers more. That was a blur. It was still a massive blur. Mm. I felt quite helpless and a bit awkward at the same time because you can't do anything. You're in a situation where your girlfriend is in a lot of pain. After a while, it was you didn't have a chance to be helpless. You had to go into adrenaline like just kicked in. So survival mode. When the nurses were telling me what to do, I had to put a nappy on for the first time. I've never done that before. Cut two umbilical cords. <laughs> they, they said it was an um, umbilical cord conveyor belt. So I literally one, two in a, <laughs> in a row. They had to weigh both of them. At the same time, Frankie was crying her eyes out, weren't you? <laughs> yeah. So I had to run and check from Frankie. I, was like, I hadn't seen Luella, that's yeah. why. And I was thinking, where is my little girl? I was like, has she got hair? Because Luella was behind the green sheet. Yeah. So if I looked to the left-hand side, I would have seen Frankie literally being operated on. Yeah. And they the told right you not to look in it. Was Luella, but when someone tells you not to look, you you have a quick little look, and I see all I see is red, and I just thought, no, no, no. and then. Yeah. <laughs> I think week one was the hardest, wasn't it? Yeah, week one was hard. I was in hospital for three days. Um, I think it was time. hard for me because you couldn't walk or do anything. Yeah, Luke literally took over, like, he's that super dad. I don't think you even realised what you had to really do. I didn't realise how much we needed you, do you know what I mean? I didn't know what I was doing. No. You've done so well. I was looking at him in hospital, like, laying in the bed because I couldn't walk or after the C-section. I was like, you're doing amazing, you're doing so amazing. That oh, I, you've done so well, I'm so proud of you. I think it's always been like a proper big deal. Like, everyone's like, oh, you're breastfeeding, you're breastfeeding. Um, 100% no, not with twins. Um, I didn't think I could breastfeed either because I've actually had an uplift. So I was told I would not be able to breastfeed when I had my uplifts and I was fine with that. Um, so I didn't think I actually could anyway. But yeah, my milk come through. I see it. It was golden milk, amazing. Yeah, if we had like one baby, that like single baby, then yeah, I'd, I, would, I would definitely try it but just to see what it feels like. And it's like a little connection, but as well, like even now the babies are here, like Luke's got to bond with them on another level, like and to feed yeah. them and change them. Like he really, honestly, it just helps so much. Like if you bottle feed, then the dad can help out. I think as well, because it's just the connection. Especially when there's two of them. Yeah, especially when there's two of them. Imagine having three. Their names, we won't start with an L because Luke's surname's Love. Um, and I've always loved the name Luella, like forever. I heard it years and years ago when I was younger. Um, and when I met Luke, I was like, oh, I was like, do you like the name Luella? I was like, don't tell anyone though, because I've never told anyone. And he said, yeah. So I was like, okay, cool. And then obviously when we found out I was pregnant with twins, I was like, oh my God, like, I need another girl's name just in case we're having two girls. And we had two boys' names, didn't we? Yeah, that really. that was done easy. Luke liked Logan or Lucas and we was we was literally just well we'll just see what he looks like when he's born and then like about three weeks ago a month ago yeah. from like yeah. today Luke was sitting on the sofa downstairs and he googled the meaning of the baby's names and Logan means little warrior and he googled Luella and Luella means female warrior so when he said that I just laughed I was like are you joking <laughs> I was like, well, there you go. Like, they're twins. Like, both of their names means warrior. Like, how have we even done that? It was like, that was not planned at all, was it? And even Joey yeah. was like, 
oh my god, their names mean warrior. And I was like, I know, like, how do you know that? And he was like, I Googled it. So yeah, that was like a no-brainer, was it? I've never really heard anyone with their names, have I? Never. I've never heard no. anyone. So like, although they're unusual names, they're still really strong names. And obviously, yeah, both mean Little Warrior and it's really cute. Our family's 100% complete. Like our first family photo is the best. Um, but what will be, will be. You never say never, um, but we're so happy and we're just so happy that our children are here and they're healthy. And yeah. I feel we're happy enjoying it. Yeah. Oh, we don't want to rush them to the next stage. No, no, Enjoy definitely stage right not. Like we're, building a, we're still building our home, you know? So yeah, one thing at a time. Well, two things at a time at the minute. Yeah. Well, about a million things because we've got a whole build going on. Concrete got laid today, <laughs> so we've got a lot to do. But um, yeah, let's get let's just get this journey. I'm just so excited about this journey now. It's so it's gonna be fun. <laughs>